Hi, this is Dr. Sue from Functional Medicine Plus. Let's talk about MSG. MSG is a flavor enhancer that we typically think of as being in Chinese food. However, it's in many, many processed foods like soups and prepared meals. It's also now found in skin products. It is cleverly disguised by a lot of other names such as hydrolyzed yeast, soy sauce, soy protein, hydrolyzed protein, malt fl flavoring, cornstarch, and natural flavorings. Always watch out about the word natural. It's labeled by the US FDA as being GRAS, G-R-A-S, meaning generally recognized as safe. I'm not sure if that invokes a lot of confidence. Uh, you may, you may want to kind of still watch out for it because it is made up primarily of an amino acid that is a small protein particle called glutamate. And glutamate is a neurotransmitter. That means it helps to send impulses along your nerves, your nerves that run completely all over throughout your body, around your brain and into your toes, into your eyeballs, everywhere, even in your heart. It's what helps your heart beat. There are symptoms that some people claim to have with MSG, like palpitations, dizziness, headache, some confusion. And if we think about the heart in general, remember I said there are nerves that run through the heart. If glutamate is speeding up those nerves, in fact, there may be a connection with the palpitations that some people feel. Now the research on MSG is a little difficult to follow because there are about um, 40 studies that have been looked at that say there are no side effects associated with it. But there was a book in 1977 written by Dr. Russell Blaylock, who is a neurosurgeon who went through many other studies that say about that many people can have side effects to glutamate or the MSG. They consider it an excitotoxin. An excitotoxin is something that overstimulates nerve cells. So you have to kind of pick and choose which research you want to uh, subscribe to, realizing that it's about 30 to 40% of people that are thought to have these side effects to, to MSG. Now, what we do know is that MSG is a chemical made in a lab. It is not a natural chemical found in foods. So that should get you to take pause just a little bit. I hope this information was helpful. Always, as we always say, try to eat natural foods, or I told you watch for the word natural, try to eat real foods, as in things that were recently alive, meat, vegetables, and fruits. Until later, bye-bye.